pulled up, but is my sister Nancy on tonight? Somebody look for me or Nancy answer? I gotta unchop my head. Nancy's on. She said she was gonna be on, okay. Hi Nancy. Oh, is is my secretary on? <laughs> I got a secretary on on the cam. I don't have to, you know, how I'm always writing down everything. I don't have to do that anymore. She'll write it down and then email it to me. Yeah, pretty cool. Thank you for doing that. Okay, well we've got we've got a big assortment tonight. We've got one, two, three, four boxes, one package, two packages, a whole bunch of um, postcards here. Uh oh, and I had a letter. Oh man, did you cats get the letter? Guys, I thought I had a letter too. See, here around here, if something's missing, I can always blame the cat. Okay, so we've got a uh, Amazon, 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 and then the rest of this is not from Amazon. So these cats don't give me very much room to work on. Yeah. <laughs> Poor Angie knows that. Ooh, this is a box within a box. That's something different. What? Oh, and no card. Oh, sugar. Um. Yeah, yeah. Petite cuisine. Six four packs gourmet cat food. What? Oh, God bless you. Let's see if I can pull this on for Petite Cuisine, I can never say that. Gorgeous cat food. Oh, whoa. Oh, these guys are going to have their noses up in the air. Oh, it's tuna. Some yellowfin tuna. I guess it's all yellowfin tuna. Oh, we got to open one of these babies and see what this is. Oh, this is cute. They're, these are all crab cake or tuna. Isn't that cool? There's, uh, I'll have to read that. One, two, there's six boxes. There's four in each, so there's 24 cans. They're like a, a fancy feet size. Yeah, fancy schmancy is right. Wow. These guys will be all over me in the morning. I'm going to keep one out and use it in the morning so I'll tell you I, I know without a doubt they'll like that but we don't know who this is from do we uh, I have a couple notes on the wall here so let me do a quick check there's the card no I um, my old symbol but that's not it nope so, do we know who this is from? Okay, no one claiming it yet? Okay. Alright, wow. Boy, these guys are going to be living high. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to give them two of each kind tomorrow morning for breakfast. They're kind of like a fancy, fancy feast, I guess. But I know they'll love it. They've been getting like mackerel. They, those are like real fish in the can there. That's really cool. They love it. And this one is another Amazon one. Hopefully we have a card. What? I don't know this one. What's this? Oh. <laughs> we gotta find out who these probably are from the same people. We gotta find out. What oh gosh, little Weasley. You're living dangerous there, fella. Oh. Oh, 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 
I love these. <laughs> now, are these for the kitties or are these for me or do we have to share? This is sardines. There's uh, 24 in here. Oh, we got to find out. I love, you don't like sardines? Isn't that funny? You either love it or you, or you hate it. Love it or you hate it. Well, I love it. Yeah, these are uh, Crown Prince Natural Skinless Boneless Sardines, hand-packed in water. Do we know who did it? From Sue Trigg? Okay, so, uh, you got, does our secretary have that down? Sue Trigg sent the crab and the tuna. Yes, sardines are good. Thank you, Sue. Camera from England. Yay, thank you. Thank you, Sue. You did the... You did the fancy smancy stuff over here. Did you also do the tuna? You did these. <laughs> yeah. Oh, and and uh, blue sent the tuna. Is that right? The sardines. Oh, okay. I see what you're doing, blue. Okay. Well, maybe we can find out about the sardines. Um. And you know what? Right now it doesn't say whether it's for the cats or the people. But we'll share. No matter what, we'll share. And whenever I do the sardines, I'm always embarrassed to take a bite of the sardines on the can because I'll think, oh my gosh, somebody will think that I'm eating cat food. So I take a little little bit of it and put it on a napkin and then go around the corner and eat it so nobody thinks I'm eating cat food. <laughs> or I eat it in the evening a whole a whole can of it oh, I love it thank you thank you thank you sent the sardines too all right thank you Sue. appreciate that so very very much you picked out good stuff this one is also from Amazon and we have a name this is from Laura H from Medic oh she was just here today this is from Medic 101, and every single month she sends us one or two cans of Fancy Feet. So thank you, Medic. She might be on tonight. Um, they were here today, her and her mama. So thank you so much, Medic. I usually remember the first of the month she usually sends one or two cases of the uh, of the Fancy Feet, and I I so much appreciate her doing that. Here, let's put that over there. Um, wow, you guys got some good food here tonight. Yeah. How you doing there, little wheezy baby? Hi, honey. And this one, let me cut this off and I can read it a little bit better. So far down there, my, my glasses don't work good. There we go. This is from... Bradenton, Florida, and it's from Rhonda M. from Bradenton, Florida. Oh, and it says to Burka and Friends, care of Friends of Felines Rescue Center. Burka's got a friend. Burka, she was on Angie's shoulder, I think, shoulders the second that Angie walked in today. Well, I think Burka's been on everybody's shoulder. And. Rhonda is very a very good packer too. Oh, 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 look at this. And look at this. They got some more mackerel. I'm telling you, I use these in the mornings for breakfast and the cats, there is nothing left on their plates when we're done. Three cans of mackerel. Oh, four cans of mackerel. Cool. They love this stuff. Sponges, good sponges here. Uh oh, what you doing there? Uh, two, three boxes of Q-tips, which we always use a lot of. You guys know that. We go through a lot of that. Oh, and Mr. Um, oh, Mr. Clean sponges. Those things. There's some things that only these things will come. It'll come off with cotton balls. You know, I don't. I think this is the first time we've ever gotten cotton balls, and yes, we do use these. So thank you. And the wide off, I used this tonight. I had to find some in the drawer. Thank you. 
and plates, which we, oh, these are really nice. We'll put those up, they, we'll put these up there with our hard plates. There's pink and there's orange. Very pretty. And last but not least, sardines. Yeah, <laughs> you got to start liking these. That's okay. Five cans of sardines. Thank you. Thank you so much. Rhonda from uh, Florida, you're awesome. Thank you, thank you. We'll put this all to good use. I'll just put this back in and then I can just pick up the whole box and put everything away. Wow. You kitties, you're going to be all fishy-fied. Yeah, you're going to be fishy-fied, aren't you? See, well, that's what you're supposed to be. Huh, okay. All right, kid. Get it away. Wow. It's kind of fun, you know, to add that kind of extra yummy stuff to the meal because... Uh, they just scarf it down. It's, I mean, they really, truly enjoy it. It's it's fun to watch them act so silly about their food. Uh, okay, let's make sure we're not forgetting something like I did the other night. Oh, this, this is from Sabrina Cat. Our favorite, one of our favorite cat, cats. We need to have Sabrina and her mama come visit us. There's a letter. I love the letters. It says, Hi Jackie. <laughs> Sorry I'm typing this, but the pen keeps slipping, slipping through my paw, so typing is easier. My mom said it was way too early to send these, but I know my friends, especially Putter, really wants this now. So please give to my special friends Putter, Patty Purrs, Patty Cakes, and Bella. Thanks for all you and the volunteers do. Sabrina T. Cat. P.S. I wanted to get one for Badu, but my mom said he might kill a volunteer, and we both agreed that Kira was too dignified for this. <laughs> oh, Badu, you got a. Oh, I know what we got. We did this last year, too. This is cool. That's what I heard jingling. You know what? What we what we'll do? We'll get um, Kurt to help us. You guys know we'll do this because we've done this. We'll get Kurt to help us, and we'll get. I will keep this letter, so I remember it's it's uh, Putter, Patty Purr, Patty Cakes, and Bella. Yeah, Kira would just about smack us too, and and Badu would say, "Are you kidding me?" And. Uh, Maybe like for the first of December, we'll take a picture. Oh no, no, Kira, or Octavia. <laughs> Octavia is trying to get a can of sardines, and it's even in this box, inside the box, inside the box. Um, we got jingle bells. We'll get, we'll do these, and I'll have four people here, and we'll take pictures of those four kitties and uh, put it on the Facebook. Okay, thank you, thank you, Sabrina. Sabrina Cat, and I'm going to keep these out until I mark it on the calendar so I don't forget, and uh, we will do that. That'll be, that'll be fun. Oh, and you know what? Also, Amy is coming. You know, she's our friend and photographer, and she's going to be coming to take pictures. I asked her if she would take, like, a Christmas picture that I can use for Christmas cards, so maybe we can use that for that. That would be, that would be fun. And then, I think we have one more, do we have one more under there? Yep. This one I did read on the outside, I thought it was funny. It says, to Houston, mistakenly called Hudson. Texas needs a new mascot because someone has to teach the Cardinals a lesson. And it's signed Z-O-T-E-7, Z-O-T-E-7. Z -O -T -E so we've got to see what this is. Yeah, Dallas, Dallas. This is neat for the Cardinals. That's funny. Okay, we gotta be careful cutting this. Would you kitties help me if I got cut? Uh huh. Whoop! Oh, little little boy. Okay, 
because someone has to teach the Cardinals a lesson. <laughs> and it, it is, it's signed Z-O-T-E-7. And it is really a Cardinal. Maybe it can be Einie's fan. The kitties would love it too, though. Here we go. Cool. I'm going to set it right here on top of this for a little while. Octavia, don't, don't take it. There we go. We got it all wrapped up there. Right smack in front where we can see it. Cool. All right. And we've got cards. Here, let's just throw those things down, okay? Okay, we got a, this is the card I was looking for. Um, we got this on Saturday, I think. You guys were so nice not to make me feel bad about not doing the boxes on Saturday. We had a hugely big weekend. Aww, picture of a doggy. Aww. Oh, this is from Bats. Is Bats on? Bats on, maybe? <laughs> this says, hi Jackie, this money is for kitty food. I want to ask you, ask how do I ask in, to name a cat best, please. You do such good work, Jackie. I'm so addicted to, to your site now. Thanks for all you do for the animals. Hugs from Beth. Um, Beth, if you're on, I'm going to go around the corner and write it on my name list right now. And um, we'll name a cat Beth then. Hang on. That's all it takes. We got we got it on there. So sometime in the future there'll be a cat named Beth. And this is what I thought was really cool today. Got the mail. We got postcards. There's three, four, five, six postcards. I love these. Um, I've told you before on the cork board out there. Uh, I've got room for. Um, to put to put pictures and postcards on. So and it's really especially cool when it has something to do with your area. So this one is from Atlanta, Georgia, and it says, um, "Oh, well, I marvel at the energy and love and excellent care you always make sure every one of your special kitties receive. We want them to have all kinds of love and and good things happen to them." I am amazed at all you do for well, oh, from well before dawn until long after sunset. Ah, uh, that's only because we got so much help here. They are all very blessed to be there in your care. Thank you. And this is Gloria. And they sometimes put a stamp on the, and the post office does, and it ran across the last name, but I think it's Gloria C. So this is from Atlanta, Georgia. And I will put this on our cork board. Thank you. Thank you, Gloria. I love having that. I really do. And this one, it says the North Bridge, Can or Concord, Massachusetts. It says, Dear Jackie, here's another card for your map. I'm, I'm now one town west of Concord, but the spirit's the same and fewer tourists. Thanks to you and all your volunteers for the love you give to every kitty that passes through your door. Oh, this is from Bantry and Smooch's uh, Putter Butter. Bantry loves Putter Butter. I think I still have... Yeah, is Bantry on? 
Do you remember Bantry when you made that a long time ago? I always keep kept that. Bantry and putter. Here, let me put this back. I keep organized for tomorrow. So thank you, Bantry. We'll add this to our, our postcard collection. These I love these. I'm having fun with these. This says Longwood Gardens. And it's beautiful. Maybe I should show these a little closer. Longwood Gardens. And it says, Dear Jackie and Volunteers, Thanksgiving greetings from Longwood Gardens. I live in Delaware but visit Longwood Gardens in Kennett Square, Pennsylvania often. Longwood helps to feed my other obsession, which is flowers. And this is from Kitty Cam. Another one of our, well, you guys all know Kitty Cam. She's on there. Thank you, Kitty Cam. I love that. This is from Wales. Check that out. That's pretty cool. That says, hi to, to all my friends at FFRC. Oh, and this is from our Patty. This is from our Patty. Uh, hi to all my friends at FFRC. I'm having a lovely time. Wish you were here. And it's signed Patty on his world tour. <laughs> Isn't that awesome? Our Patty. We'll, we'll have to um, add this to all the things that we'll have from uh, when we get the Patty travel box back. That definitely has got to go in there. And this one. Ooh, check that one out. This is from Montreal. Yeah, boy, you guys are teaching Patty all kinds of good things. I didn't know Patty could write either. This says, Dear, F or Dear Jackie and FFRC family, Happy Thanksgiving. So wonderful what you do for the kitties. Our, our human and feline family watch you every night. Oh, love and kisses from all of us. French cat and family. Danielle, Jean, Felix A., and their cats are Norman, I think it is, uh, Sissy, and Leah. Thank you. So, French cat and family. Thank you. I love that one. I'm going to get a bigger cork board. We're going to have fun with these. Thank you. I love that. And this one is from um, Washington, D.C. Of course, our national, uh, oops, up, our capital. And this is from our wonderful friend, Mimi. Aw, and she says, Jackie, I'm typing this because my handwriting is so bad from arthritis. Oh, that's too bad. It's been a tough year topped off with an earthquake. These lovely buildings and monuments got cracked a bit, but they're still standing. And from for what and for that I am thankful. I'm also thankful for so much more, especially for you creating FFRC and sharing it with us all. On the darkest day, it brings a touch of sunshine and joy. I hope that you, your family, volunteers, friends, and all the kitties, dogs, chickens, and others have all have a wonderful and happy Thanksgiving. Love and kisses, Mimi. Mimi, thank you. I love that. I love that. So we'll add all of these um, to our cork board there in the office for everybody to be able to see and to share. And... Um, that's pretty cool. I like that. And Bats, I, I don't think you're on tonight, but we'll we'll um, get that cat name on there for you. So, let me see here. I got a few things. I lost my thing. Ha, 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 ha. I think it's up here. We had a, I have a couple things here. Oh, hey, that cough was from for my sister Nancy. Nancy, if you're on, that cough was from you. That's the only cough I did. Ha ha ha. Um, medic and her mom. Uh, Laura is medic and Belinda is her mom. They were here. They drove down yesterday. It's a three and a half hour drive. They stayed at a motel last night and they were here all morning and part of the afternoon. Had a wonderful, wonderful time with them. Uh, I even put them to work. <laughs> they, they, uh, a lot of our syringes that we get are in packages, and we have to do what I call undress them. So, just means taking them out of their packaging and put the syringe and needle in a box. And they did probably 
2,000 syringes for me. Maybe it was an awful lot. And get this, they brought they brought a whole bunch of wonderful stuff for us for the kitties. There was uh, canned chicken, cat treats, friskies. There was even treats for er Einstein and the dog. Uh, paper towel, baby food, Clorox. And there's uh, also cookie treats for the volunteers. And there was another uh, tin for cookies for me, but we're all sharing it. And I want to show you this. <coughs> um, Medic made these. I showed them this morning earlier, but I'll just do these real quick. These are that flannel stuff that washes and dries real easy. These will look this nice even months from months from now after we've washed them all the time. She made a whole bunch. She made a huge one for my Z's to snuggle in. That little yellow cat. This one here I thought was really cute. The penguins. And see in the back is different. Just think how many knots she had to tie on these. And I swear they're all perfect knots. I'm saving for the last, the special one. This one I thought was really cute. The squirrelies. Christmas squirrely. This was another really sweet one. And she color coordinated the back on them. Like this one is red. This one's a rainbow one. Yeah, raccoons. <laughs> and then uh, a squirrely one. And then last but not least, Oh, I guess I better put these over here. It is one for Putter. And I'm going to put this where Putter sleeps at on the yellow table. You know, she's from Indiana. She's a big Purdue fan. So Putter gets a Purdue blinky. And this is supposed to be for Putter. Isn't this nice? These will wash and dry just beautifully. That's a lot of work, a lot of knot tying. She did a really, really good job on them. But she, and then she made like a bedside one for all my kitties inside, especially for the Z's because they snuggle under the blankies. So I appreciate everything that, that her and her mom brought for us. Um, well, I, since I didn't do Saturday or Sunday, and I'm really sorry about that, uh, I wanted to let you know that we did do the 25 surgeries. That was on the blog today. Uh, everything went beautifully. Uh, Dr. Cindy started at 9. Physicals were done by 9.45. 10 o'clock we started on the boys. Right after the boys, we had seven boys, I believe it was, and we did all the girls. And she was done at 3.45. I was just amazed. She's awesome. So she's, she still will continue doing our surgeries up to a point where she can't do them anymore because of her new job but I, I've got two other vets that are willing to help us out also with our surgery just for FFRC so once every like four or five weeks we'll schedule and uh, get get Dr. Cindy in here again to do it and I think I did mention to a lot of you that uh, we're, we're not going to be doing them in the clinic anymore since it's only one every four or five weeks we're going to do them in our big office the furniture will go down to one end. We'll have a huge big area to do surgery. We've already moved in the oxygen tank and the, um, the isofluorine machine and all of our supplies. It's already all in there in cabinets. And um, it's going to be really nice for us. The kitties will be here. No more transferring them back and forth. You know, it'll make it real easy for all of us. Uh, DCTV was here today. They, they do a half hour filming of the events that's going on here and I also showcase some of the cats and uh, they will air that real quickly because that's the November one they come the first I think it's going to be always now the first Monday of, of each month so uh, we'll do it again in December um, that's that's on the, it's called DCTV. I, I know a lot of you guys can't see it, but they do usually run off a, a disc for us, and Kurt then puts it on uh, you, YouTube for us. We're doing, um, we, we, we actually have two, <coughs> um, 
two uh, fundraising events going on right now. One of them is at Pet Supply Plus. They're kind enough to do uh, just asking people as they check out money for to help support the rescue center. So that's really nice of them, wonderfully nice of them. And the other one is just down the road at Foods for Living. And what they're doing is if you want to donate like a dollar, they pick out this card and with it, it has a kitty's picture on there that was adopted from here. They sign their name and it'll go up on the wall. If they want to donate five dollars or more, there's a little mouse that we've uh, put a Christmas sticker on. Then on the other side of the Christmas sticker, they can write their name with the amount. And we also then glued a little, um, a little a little um, clamp on it. A little clamp on it, and then that mouse with all this on it will get attached to a Christmas tree. So I'm hoping we'll have a whole lot of those mousies on on the tree. Remo is doing awesome. He is doing really good. It took him like all of what two minutes down on the floor to really regain his his balance, and he's just doing really really well. He's uh, not running yet, but he certainly is walking around really well. He's eating good, and uh, he's, I was thinking he was just down here, but I don't see him. I'll try to find him and show him to you. His, his wound is just uh, healing beautifully. He's, he's doing a really good job. Stop it. He was uh, back behind you, Jack. He's on that pillow. That's what I thought that he had been. No, behind the cat tree. Keep going. Behind you. Oh, there he is. While we know where he's at, I'll show you right now. There's Remo. You know, he's just a really a cool little boy. He's got kind of that terracotta color nose on him. And there's his little shaved hiney area, uh, his incision. We're going to take those out. I think it's next Saturday or this coming Saturday. Looks really good. This is an awesome kitty. Just just a real sweetie pie. And while I have him, I'm going to go ahead and put him in Cat's Corner Room so he's in there for the night time. We'll get another bed in there, baby, in just a minute. Uh, Tukey, I've got information on Tukey. Uh, Connie Andrews that adopted Tukey uh, emailed me today, and Tukey's doing awesome. She's been to the vet. She's gained weight. And they're going to be visiting here November 25th for Thanksgiving, and they're going to stop by and visit us, so that will be really nice. This morning was really awesome also, and, and in addition to having Medic and her mom here, I had two of my sisters here, Nancy and Judy. Judy's a volunteer on, on uh, Tuesday, and Nancy's my sister. That's one up from me. She even scooped boxes, but she missed half of them. Sorry, Nancy, I had to say that. Um, we had a really nice visit. She brought some pictures of my my dad when he was younger, so that was kind of fun. Um, yeah, we had a good time. Nancy is leaving Thursday for um, like a three-month trip, so I'm real happy for her and her husband, Larry. Uh, CJ is doing okay. She's doing better. I do have a possible home for CJ. I should know more tomorrow. It's somebody that was here a week or two ago and it had and had visited CJ. Um, they're connected with one of the vets offices out of town and they have some food for us. So I might just make the trip. I might take CJ myself, go to the vets office, pick up the food, leave CJ with her, and uh, then bring the food back. So I might do that and uh, and see. Uh, I think that this person will give CJ a nice, quiet home, and that's what we want. Cats on porch. Oh, the cats were outside all day today. We had 60-degree weather, although it did start raining, and they were out there on the outdoor enclosure. Tomorrow is supposed to be, I think, no rain, and in the 60s again, and uh, they will probably go out there again tomorrow because it won't be long until they won't be able to do that. Then our questions tonight. Oh my goodness, I really got to write better. See. Oh dear. Okay, um, I'll go to one I can read. Yuki asked how you tell the difference of sage and shale. 
uh, sage and shale are both of the calicos. And you know I keep telling you guys I have little tricks to help me remember. Well, shale kind of sounds like pale. So we have a calico and then we have a calico that has more white on it. So the whiter calico, because she's paler, is shale. So the, the calico that has more white is shale. The one that has more of the calico markings is uh, sage. And then, here, can I have you? Let's show you. Okay. Then the two torties is Kozo and Zoom. And see how this one has gold here? Boy, that might be hard to see, but this one has gold. So this one is... Um, Kozo. Aha! Here, can you see the difference? Kozo has more gold on her. And Zoom has more brown. And this is how, this sounds silly, I know, but I have to do these things to help remember names. Zoom is because he was zooming around so fast to put the fire out so he doesn't have as much gold or orange into him. Does that make sense? So this is Zoom. This is Kozo. Kozo has more orange. Does that make sense? <laughs> you have to look good on these two. Clear as mud. <laughs> you guys are going to have a test later. Uh, Joe asked if Dee is coming back. Yes. I'm not sure if she'll be back tomorrow. She really misses her kitty, her cat that died, and she's just having a hard time uh, with that loss. So she may miss one more Tuesday, but I'm sure then we'll get her back. Uh, Goss, Goss asked if Shasta ate today. Shasta ate today. Shasta is super ornery. Um, she's awfully cute. I don't see her at this very moment, but she's healthy, rearing, and um, rips around here like a crazy girl. M.K. Mouse and Sarah Sarah asked about my dad and mom, if I enjoyed that. Uh, you know, I was really tickled when on Friday uh, when my mom said something about maybe they could come over on Sunday because you know they used to come over a lot on Sunday mornings for our breakfasts that we have but they were real curious about the floor and so I asked David if he wanted to come and at first you know he just didn't think he could and so I told him if you can come the second you say you want to go home We'll pack you up and take you home. So he thought he would try it. My son Sam is the one that always goes and gets them on when they have come before on Sundays. And you know he did pretty good. I was really surprised. He had a little hard time with the steps over there, but um, he did really good. And he and he ate fairly good here too. So I was pleased. I was I was very very pleased that that they got to come. I explained about CJ's people. A uh, little one of mine uh, asked, oh boy, I am so sorry. I wrote so fast, I didn't, can't read it. Little one of mine, if you remember what your question was, pop it back on there if you can. Shit. Oh, that's terrible. I'm sorry. Um, Angel 3 asked about her Halloween card. Yes, because I do. I did get that E Halloween card. And talk to be. I think that's the right way you say it. Uh, Cessna is, if Cessna is doing good, Cessna is doing awesome. That little kitty has such a cute round head and round big bulgy eyes. Everybody likes her. She is just a real sweetheart. Um, oh, you're in camp actually. Wow. Yeah, uh, Cessna's doing great. The, she just fit right in as soon as we left her out. Birds are at us asked um, if Remo is going to be in with the babies tonight. Yes, I think I think that's a good idea. At least for a couple more nights. And personally, I feel better with the five babies in Cat's Corner room for nighttime because there's a couple cats out here who like to play way too rough with the babies. So. That way I don't have to worry about them. And then Mishka's, uh, Mishka uh, asked about where Putter is, and or where uh, Patty's is. This is my list that I think is still current. It's, uh, well, of course, Defiance. Then, it, then he went to London, 
Scotland, Wales, and the last I heard is Burnley, Lancashire, in UK. Now this, yeah, here's what, and this is the one when uh, Patty was in Wales. So I would imagine that he's going to be leaving the UK area fairly soon. So we'll get to see some more areas too. I think it's been fun. I've enjoyed that. I know today we got a, a email about posting the letters from where he's at now or pictures. So those I think might be up tomorrow. I think. So I think that that's all I have. Um, anybody have anything I missed? Yeah, Cobbis. Oh my goodness, that boy is one ornery dude. Oh, I'll show you, and I'll show you guys Lilo, too, here. Give me your Lilo. Oh, my goodness. Isn't she pretty? She's very pretty. Oh, she's such a nice kitty. She's doing really well. Check names on first... Oops, wait a minute. Check names on first two boxes. We we never know what movie we're going to see until we get there, uh, mainly because we kind of have to go on what time it is for when Steve gets off of work. She's yeah she you you mean uh, socialize for Lilo? She's doing she's doing much better even today. And actually, she was down on the floor in the main office. Uh, quite a bit this morning with the door shut so she stayed in there. She just sat on the floor just as calm as can be and watched the kitties. Yeah, for cries where she wanted out or, yeah, she just didn't want to be in there. But she's calming down. She's doing really Dr. well. Amanda wanted to write down. She ends up finding one out of the She did. Yeah. Yeah, this one she spoke, stayed in uh, Dequad already. I don't know. That's a good question, Anna Marie. I'm not sure. If they call, I will certainly let them know. I don't remember how much she weighs. I think she was only like eight or nine. Med bottle on tree. Oh, that's where the wormer wormer med went. Thank you. <laughs> but I'll get it. Yeah, she's not that big. She could wait. She could gain some more. You carry around new kid? Yeah. You know, we've all been uh, she's been carried around a little bit extra today. And uh Nuki Nuki just needs a little more socialization, I think. Whoops. Oh yeah. Aww. And uh, what is that? Check the names on the first two boxes. See, I didn't have names on them. Are you talking these here? The sardine or the tuna? This was the sardine. Yeah, there weren't any names on them. I thought, I thought, oh, on the mailing label? Nope, it just says Crown Prince. Oh, and this one was in that box. You know, it wouldn't be on the mailing label because uh, these are Amazon. I know Quayside gets her names on them sometimes. Yeah, these don't. Let me check the other box. Oh, yes. This one does say Quayside, Elaine and Willis. What came out of this one? That's it. That's the answer. Um, so the crab cake and tuna can is from Quayside. I'm not sure how 
Holly Lane gets that on there, but as far as I know, it's the only one from Amazon that that has got the name on there. So yeah, these these uh the petite cuisine, the gourmet cat food is from Quayside. Thank you for noticing that. So are we all set? Um did they arrive Saturday? Yes. I believe those I believe those are the ones that was here Saturday. Cardine, did both I I'm pretty sure they both were here Saturday. All the boxes look alike after a while. Cessna, Cessna is let me see if I can find it. This is Cessna. Oh, and you know what? Did you guys all see who was adopted tonight? It turned out it wasn't. Um, Rizzo, after all, they ended up taking um, Amara. Yeah, that's that. That kitty's going to be spoiled rotten with those two. They just, they just loved her. Isn't he cute? He's sleepy. <laughs> yes, I need to go to Betty Bye. more white she has on her so that's shale and this one is sage yeah I always go by that how much white and who you guys know what this is who this is don't you that's little Nuki yeah there's for your Nuki moms on there I bet yeah yeah, Reno's been sleeping on the big squishy blue bed. That was Bella's. Oh, Potter, okay. Yeah, I said I got my tummy shaved. This is a nice, she's a nice sweetie. And B is doing awesome. B, Bumblebee, acts like she's never not been here. No, I know. Butter, butter, they're making me do it. They're making me do it, butter. Besides, we have to give you your new blankie. Oh, here's your butter boy. Mm. How can you not but love him? He was sleeping. He is a big boy. him smack somebody. The kitties were playing a little rough and one of them rolled over and rolled over and hit his front leg and he um then he then he looked at me like I didn't do it. He is a big boy. He's wonderful. We love you, butter. He's back in we'll go back in there, buddy. Okay, are we all set? Okay, well, I'll put things away. Thank you guys so much for everything. And uh, I always, always like spending time with you guys. You guys have been patient with me the last couple of days. <laughs> it's been crazy here. Oh, thank you, Carolina Ash. That helps me a whole lot, a whole lot. All righty. Thanks, everybody. And, and please keep voting. Did you see that? We jumped up. Did you see that, Angie? 
I didn't. I was not on the computer. No, well, you were, early this you were painting. We're up to 2.25. Isn't that awesome? I told you. I just, I know, Angie <laughs> predicted this. Angie predicted that we were going to take this one. The beginning of the year. Yeah, uh, yeah, from the beginning of the year she told me that. I remember. I still, I just think it's amazing. Truly amazing. Okay, kitties, let's do some cleanup. I got putter here in my mouth, I think. All right, cool postcards. You guys in your bath, tub, tubes. Oh, are you comfortable? 